Indeed, indeed, indeed. Here we bless God for Jesus. Amen. We thank God for each and every one of you today in Radio Land today. Definitely, indeed. And today I just want to say happy birthday to my mom. Lord. Celebrating her birthday today. We bless God for you, mommy. I love you so much and I thank you for my life. Thank you for all that you have done. Great mother, indeed. Thank you so much. Now I look back and I thank you for all that you have done. Thank you so much. Thank you for my life. Thank you for loving me so much. Thank you, Jesus, for my mother. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you for my mother today. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Continue to keep her. Hallelujah to your name. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for my mother. Thank you, Lord. The Lord is gracious and compassionate. Slow to anger and rich in love. Lord is gracious and compassionate, slow to anger and rich in love. And the Lord is good to all, and He has compassion. Know that He has. Hallelujah, we bless God, rich in love indeed. And as Psalm 90 and 12 say, that teach us to number our days aright, and we may gain a heart of wisdom. Amen. So we bless God once again. I'm just saying hi to my mom, and she's celebrating her birthday today. And I just am grateful for my life, and you know, thank God for mother, for mothers. Amen. Hallelujah. My definitely, my mother was a woman that I mean. You know, she definitely tried her best with me, and I look back today, and I know that she gave it all she had with the little that she had. Amen. Bless God. Thank you, Mommy, for your love. Amen. Happy be a be a be a birthday to you. Happy be a be a be a birthday to you. Happy be a be a be a birthday. Happy be a be a birthday. Happy be a be birthday to 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 you.
hope is gone Downtown in a rush crowd And felt all alone Every now and then I felt like I would lose my mind I've been racing for years And still no finish line But then I climbed the hills and saw the mountains I hollered help cause I was lost And I felt the strong wind Heard a small voice saying the storm is over for my mother lord thank you father thank you for my mother today amen i know she always always prayed for me sometimes she called me and tell me you know i went to pray for you today hallelujah we bless god thank you mommy hallelujah thank god for you so much thank god for you we pray that you will make it in the gate of heaven thank you jesus thank you for my mother today all right the final scripture is taken from galatians 5 and 16 that's where we end it all hallelujah he said here in galatians 5 and 16 this i say then walk in the spirit and ye shall not fulfill the lust of the flesh for the flesh lusted against the spirit and the spirit against the flesh and these are contrary one to the other so that he cannot do the things that he would but if ye be led of the spirit ye are not under the law now the works of the flesh are manifest which are these hallelujah adultery fornication uncleanliness lasciviousness idolatry witchcraft hatred variance emulations wrath strife sedition heresy envy murders drunkenness revelings and such like of the which i tell you before as i've also told you in time past that they which do such things shall not inherit the kingdom of god but the fruit of the spirit is love joy peace long-suffering gentleness goodness faith meekness temperance against such there is no law and they that are christ have crucified the flesh with the affections and lust if we live in the spirit let us also walk in the spirit let us not be desirous of vain glory provoking one another envying one another brethren if a man be overtaken in a fault ye which are spiritual restore such a one in the spirit of meekness considering thyself lest thou also be tempted bear ye one another's burden and so fulfill the law of christ amen so we bless god we thank you so much we thank everybody for listening and we pray that you have enjoyed the segment some way somehow and understand the you know our thing here at choice radio we are about jesus we are about the word of god you have to harden up your heart for the truth of the word of god that you will make your calling and your election sure there is so much deception in the world and we are here for the leaders we're not against the church we're not against the pastors we just want to speak thus said the lord according to the word of god have us to look into the word of god and see what god is saying amen that's all it is and so we're taking our time and we look into the word of god together as believers in jesus and to make our calling and our election sure because god have asked us to do that Hallelujah. He says, study to show yourself approved unto God, a workman that need not be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of God. Amen. You might find something in the Bible and you get ashamed of it. And you decide you're not going to change to conform to it. But the point of it, you know it. Hallelujah. 
Amen. So the word of God is there, a lamp unto our feet and a guide unto our part. Amen. So we thank God for his word. He's never left us, not forsake us. What a mighty God we serve. Amen. What a mighty, awesome God we serve. He's awesome. Amen. So thank you so much for listening today. We bless God for each and every one. We pray that you have a beautiful day. Father, we just thank you for your love. We thank you for your grace. We thank you for your mercy. We thank you for all that you have done in our life. Help us to keep running this race that is set before us. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen.